strange is just how much they blend in, except for that. Pick that one out. Because they're rather small, that's why. Alright, so we spoke to uh, Olginski's heir, and now we're gonna go do some other stuff, like when the map, whenever the map comes up, uh, we're gonna go, someone is selling a revolver. We are not purchasing a revolver. But, uh, all right, let's go, since we're right there, let's go talk to Stock. I think we are just right there. And surely, he does not actually believe we've committed patricide. I mean, of all people, why would we commit patricide? Uh-oh. Don't like that. Some evenings, I guess it's evening, yeah, it's like, uh, 6, 6 p.m. Is this? I keep saying this place. Oh, yeah, this place, okay. Oh, it is just right there. I didn't realize. When trying to run for my life, I was only right there. But I guess we can also go to the station, but the station's so far away and I want to go visit... Uh, what's her name? Olginski's daughter. Since she's on the list. We haven't lost anyone. But there have been some deaths in the town. People have gone missing, and such. Uh, do we go upstairs? Or, no? They'll know. They'll know now that we're such a public figure. Now that we're part of the community that once wanted to murder us. They will know- oh god, it's Cora, stop that. No! Ah! Cats! They're adorable and fuzzy, but they just- they don't have a sense of- Oh, what's going on here? Hello. The rain. The goddamn rain. Does it ever end? Is that Laura? Pouring and pouring and pouring and pouring. Who knocks on your door at night? Who screams down your chimney? A white? No. Just the wind. I... I kind of want to scream down someone's chimney. I don't know how that would turn out. But hey, Laura! I didn't expect to see you here. I hope you're not, uh... in a thing. A hundred years? No. No, too much. Forty? No. Not nearly enough. You say so. Uh, so here we are again. I managed to calm down Stock. He was wrong about you, or he was not entirely right, at least. Um... Uh, what got into him? Should let him speak for himself. But I want to talk to you first. He can wait. He can always wait for you, Laura. Uh, were you already offered your father's inheritance, Cub? Refuse it. I beg you, do not follow his path. Uh, why would I refuse? I don't know if I can properly explain this. There is no happiness down this path. Not for yourself or others. Your father's path was cruel, Cub. Uh, my father? Cruel? I mean, he just, he taught me how to cut people. He was a kind man, but his deeds were, they were ruthless. Um, what do you mean? All in all, this is a quiet town. Not perfect, but there's a place for everyone. We're all connected through bonds of love, friendship, of patience. Uh, life flows through those bonds, the town's veins, and to cut them would cause harm. Your father, don't be mad, he dreamed of remaking it all. What does that mean, remaking it? He just, he, he got so sick and tired of the layout of the streets, he just like, just burn it all down, we'll start over, this is a mess. Absolute mess. Um... What exactly did he want to change? Everything! 
Our town fell wrong to him because its layout is so absurd. He used to say that broken bones set badly will cripple a man, leaving him unable to function as others do. To a sea door, our town was a vile malunion. Perhaps he thought that for a reason. He was a healer, sure. He knew life as no one else could. The kin referred, revered him, but even that did us more harm than good in the end. What do you mean? Five years ago, there was an outbreak in the crude sprawl. It spread like wildfire, dozens and dozens dead. People sent for a sea door. It was like a shadow just passed by right behind me. That was weird. Uh, when he arrived, he, he ordered the whole quarter to be quarantined. He locked them up and he set them on fire. No, no one could leave. Not even the healthy people trapped inside. Because eventually they would become sick. Um, that's terrible, but I'd make the same call in his shoes. The townsfolk obeyed his orders without question. They barricaded the whole neighborhood. In the end, there was almost no survivors. But the town lived on, so yeah, there were survivors. I suppose that is true, but Cub, do not take his inheritance. Isidore's inheritance is his power, his authority, his duties. If you become another Isidore, we will never rest. We will never know peace because you will barricade the entire town and burn it down. There will be no survivors except those who escape. Um... I see what you mean, dear Gravel. I will think about it. I'll rest when I've been buried. Aha, yes. Five years ago, soon after I left the town, the town that shall not be named, an outbreak of a horrible disease happened here. Father destroyed it. Together with the carriers. Some things aren't bound to happen. All right, that looks like everything. Okay, Laura. Thanks for the warning. If only you were there at the funeral to they warn me before. Happily ever after, and horribly ever before. But you're just so full of sunshine. Love it. Okay, stock. Look at this. Look at this clothing. This person. All the wisdom you gain, you pay for in pain. Well, yeah, it makes sense. Uh, stock Reuben, he's just, he's the stock for Reuben. Uh, why did you come? Finally thought of some excuses. Um, uh, you think I need to justify myself to you? Yesterday, I was told you had killed your father. Uh, and you immediately believed it. It's not far from the truth, Barak. You know, all this time I'm not a murderer. You just meant it as, what, some metaphor? I called you a friend. You betrayed him. You left when he needed you most. He cried out for your help, but you didn't care. He was in peril, and you were too busy elsewhere. He believed, truly believed, that your arrival would put an end to his troubles. And as always, he was right. He died. He doesn't have to worry anymore. Uh, take a breath, calm down, explain. What peril? What do you know? Is there going to be another plague? No. You wouldn't tell me. I suggested we wait for you to arrive. But you were in no hurry, were you? His first letter was sent in May. Uh, I only got a single letter two, maybe three weeks ago. Laura said I'm stupid, that I lost my marbles, but I haven't. Your father always taught us to take stock of the situation, Burak. Overall, you're unneeded here. Don't bother with your father's inheritance. He has better heirs, like me, and I will inherit Laura's love as well. <laughs> uh... Uh, like you, huh? And why not? I was his student. I preserved his knowledge while you wiped your ass with his letters. I watched. 
I was always by his side. Um, including the night he was murdered. Shut up. Your father's inheritance is his work, Barak. That's his legacy. You are completely unworthy of it. His work is not yours. His knowledge is not yours. You abandoned both. He sent me away, jackass. He wanted me to study elsewhere. He wanted me to broaden my horizons. Go elsewhere, then. Learn whatever it is you'll learn there. Here, you have no place. And if the kin tells you to let go of his burden, listen. Perhaps even that scum can be right sometimes. You're out of your depth here. Um. Poor stock. You know, I, I don't even want to hit you anymore. It's just so sad listening to you. Fun! And then we got sassy, uh, mask person. So he's one of the bones. Oh, the eighth. Yes, the eighth is in danger. I don't know who that is. Uh, Capella. Capella, a grace, the, uh, one who does... Uh, no, that was Yulia. Yulia, the one who designed this place. And we only have one blood. The other blood died. I don't know who the eighth is, but, uh... We're sassy man. Reuben is an idiot. Yes, thank you. Any more to say? Well, if you don't mind, I'm gonna raid your cover. Oh, I already did. <laughs> uh, don't buy me. I just have to eat and survive, unlike, like you, Reuben. Who? Who is breathing in my ear? Ah. Do you, oh, invisible walls. Do you believe? Been in here, broken. Let's just take it in case. I mean, I highly, highly doubt I'm gonna go to the theater tonight. Let's take it just in case and let's save. We're not done yet. Got a timer. We're only at like 12 minutes. Considering the fact that these playthroughs have taken so very long, mostly because I haven't had quite the time to record. Doesn't seem like it would take much to record, but it takes actually quite a long, a long, a lot to do to get everything set up. To pick a good time when I'm not going to be interrupted. My time is not my own. It saddens me at this, this day and age. I don't even know what that means. I just said it. All right, let's go. Gods, that is that the eighth? No, not Kin is over there. Murky. Let's go see Capella. Bella Capella. Okay, we just hit the end. Not even gonna jump. No need for that. Maybe we will. Hey, you wanna talk? Got some. Kashk. Grindstone. I'm not giving you. Although, I'm tempted to give you the candle stub, not right now. Herb Bride, I'm sorry, I don't, I don't like the makeup. Not my thing, I'm gonna be honest. Looks more like courtesan. Courtesan. Doesn't sound right when I say it. But I do like the music. I was listening to the soundtrack for the first game. And it sounds very, you know, late 90s, early 2000. Electronic. Not bad, but you know. Very, very indicative of the time. And while I haven't listened to too much of this soundtrack, it's still been pretty decent. Or I should say, I haven't independently listened to it outside of the game. There's still bodies here. No. 
cleaned up the bodies. There's some kind of wreckage. I don't know if we should explore or just hurry on to the to the target, to the next quest. Oh, here we are. Not that far. Ooh, let's grab that. I was kind of concerned whether or not stuff would show up in places I've already looted, but I think it might. In which case, that is exciting, and I don't think I go through there to talk to her. Do you believe I go through here? Ah! Ah ha! Ah, you person! A card! My wife was killed yesterday. How can I look our children in the eyes? I'm sorry. Uh, I could have been assertive. It seems like this is another guy. I need to be bolder. Unfortunately... Yeah, I don't... It, it, a lot of people have been losing their wives. I don't want to risk it. This one. Not that there was anything to talk about with her, just trading. Possibly request for repair. I wish I could just go up to strangers and be like, I have no idea how to fix this, can you help me? But I guess that's what, you know, the internet is for. Oh. We're out here. We can't talk to her. I like her outfit. She has a decent sense of fashion. Now where is Bella Capella? Or would it be Capella Bella? I don't know. Let's save. Not that I'm gonna save scum. Or have I. And I did not mean to phrase that as a question. A vagrant has bestowed her crude grace upon the Saburos. Saburos. The way she says Saburos. I don't know. I can't do accents. I wish I could do accents. I just can't. I can't intentionally do accents. It's not my... not my thing. Uh, did something happen? You look worried. Um... I want to I want to ask you something. I want to ask why you've been on this note that my father uh, gave me in his little marsupial pouch. Go ahead. Uh, he and he is my father in this case, my deceased father, by the way. Uh, he wrote this note. Here, take a look. Why are these names listed together? Why is yours on here too? You know what? I don't know, but I have a suspicion. Mm. Are we all gonna die soon? Uh, why are you frowning? Is it something bad? Well, no. About a year ago, your father began to seek our company. Yeah. He started to get real weird in his later years. We all met together sometimes in twos or threes. You know, orgy. Uh, it happened naturally. It just... You know, everyone has needs. He taught us, I suppose, but not anything special. I mean, I already knew how to do a lot of that stuff. I think it was more about passing down something. Something of great importance. Like a child. My god, she's pregnant with our brother or sister. Can't make heads or tails of what you're saying. It's just... It, it sounds like it could have gone either way. Well, you're an outsider now. It's difficult to explain what town orgies are like. We kids have our own town within the town. Is she that young? I hope it's not a case of that she's she's that young and I've been making even, even more inappropriate of jokes. I'm going to have to stop because she referred to herself as kid. Uh, a separate one and we govern it on our own. Don't give me that patronizing look. It's not some game. You wouldn't understand anyway. Um, go on, please. I'll do my best, despite the fact I grew up here and I know all about it already. But I'm not gonna be a little rude about it. Your father was, he was shrewd. He could see beneath crude earth, petty lies and hard truths, On used to say. 
Khan didn't like him much, but even he got out of the polyhedron to talk to him. He believed we were the ones who would remake this town, rebuild and conduct it in the future. Uh, conduct the town? Did you mean govern or what? No, a town is like music. You, you must play, writing the composition as you go, all while minding the harmony. Are you a musical person? Unfortunately, I'm not. Exactly like real life. Uh, that's what he was preparing us for, changing the town. I can see it now. He taught each of us something important. Perhaps, perhaps he gave a piece of himself to us. Yes, that must be what he did. I wasn't quite conscious for all of it. Well. Oh, Dad, I shall not woolly vanish, no. Always that sly fox. <laughs> That's such a weird response. Uh, father believed that the children on his list are key to the town's future. Guess I should keep an eye on them in the future. Yes, they are all children. Khan is in the polyhedron. Capella is the leader of the town's children. She might know what father wanted with the ones on the list. I already spoke with her. I should probably speak with her again. It's probably an option. No? Well, we got a... Got an option to go to the polyhedron, or we could talk to Subarov. I'm on the fence about it. Or we could go to the station. You know what, let's go talk to Subarov, since he's right there. And then we'll try to hit up the polyhedron if we have time. I would say that this probably will end up turning out to be at least two playthroughs. It just takes so damn long to do it. It is rather... Uh, did I save? Do I need to save? No, no, it's fine. Fine. Um, but yes, it takes so damn long and... Still want to try out The Bachelor in the original. And then, I would really like to try out... Let's grab that. Let's just... Never mind, it's just an empty bottle. Don't need that. Um, and then afterwards, try out... How's my health? How do I find out my health? Where's... No, wait. Gods. Dang it. Just always so goddamn hungry. Just always hungry. You would think he was a teenager with how hungry he always is. I don't know. I don't want to talk to you. I want... Oh, smoked fish. Yes. What do you want? You want my matches or you want my important stuff? I don't want to give it to you. Ah. Uh, Jeez. I don't... Damn it. Why couldn't you be like the other kids? want, I don't know, walnuts and peanuts. It says kids will sell their souls for this stuff. Uh oh, I don't like. Okay, sooner or later I can't run from my fears. I eventually have to go home. Uh, but there's so much I want to do. I'm going to have to sleep because apparently I'm facing exhaustion. Oh, hey, Chisel. We're taking that. Gods, if only I found such useful stuff when I used to dumpster dive. I'm, I'm hearing stuff, and I don't know how I feel about what I'm hearing. I hear chanting. I have a feeling after this we're going to have to go to his father's house. And then, and then we're going to have to sleep, and then someone's going to die. 
Someone is going to die. This person is going to die. The eighth will die. More than likely. All right. I think that's Subarov. Whoever. Oh, jeez. You know, sometimes the controls just don't do what I'm trying to get them to do. So pressing forward ends up making me go left. Or nothing at all. Stupid. I was so stupid. You're right. I wasn't the murderer. You were so stupid. Oh, it's you. We made you a prime suspect yesterday by mistake. Sorry, that was that was rash. You were too convincing a subject. You know, just being out of town when your father died, it was it screamed guilty, okay? But I won't hear you complain. The error wasn't irrevocable. Right, not like you had me executed or anything. Nothing irrevocable about being branded a murderer and hunted like a dog. <clears throat> Spare me the sarcasm, Barakin. Stop your whining. Let's get this straight. You're still a suspect. I mean, you were on a train when your father died, but you're, you're still a suspect, and you'll be a suspect until the murderer is found and proven guilty. The only reason you're walking free is something called the presumption of innocence. Do I make myself clear? Good thing some smart people told you about that. Anything else I can help you with? My house is locked. Do you have the key? The house was locked by the committee that examined the crime scene. Because our investigators don't do it. It's a committee. <laughs> there may be evidence. It's in your best interest and that to the committee. The investigation... That doesn't exist. Great. You may have the key. The house is your property and I have no legal grounds to prevent you access. So, can I go home now? If you want to go immediately, you won't be allowed in anyway. Why? The district was block off, uh, blocked off on my orders. And Bachelor Denkovsky's advice. <laughs> he is younger and more skilled and more attractive than you are, so I listened to him. Uh, but I recall you're a doctor, correct? I mean, I think you're a hack, but you're a doctor, right? Yes, so sign a pass for me and I'll leave you alone. Barbara, All right. Barber's leading the gang. <laughs> Some barber. Awesome. Well, home sweet home is locked. The local authorities must have the key. I can't keep pretending. This doesn't concern me. I have the key to my home now. Just, yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go sleep. Gotta go sleep it off. Hang on, is there anything else he wants to say? Nope. That's it. Nothing else. Is there any other reason? To hang around, loot, maybe. It's like stairs down here, and I just, I kind of want to. You know what? I, I, I don't need to be down here. I don't need to rummage. No, I really want to. Who are you guys? What are you guys doing here? Huh? Looks like we're not talking. That's fine. I'll see myself out. Okay, we are extraordinarily tired. So if I go this way, just run my ass off. Perhaps, just perhaps, we'll get there in time. Before we die of exhaustion, hang on, I need a loot. Because you know what? I don't want to lose the ability to hug. I don't know what that sound is. I think it means, yes, there are herbs nearby. I don't really have time for this. I'm gonna be honest. Do I have coffee? Got morphine. 
<laughs> if I take this, I'll recuperate better. They'll sell their souls for it, but good luck finding someone who will actually do that. Ooh, what is that place? No time to investigate. We gotta run. I am unwelcome here. The tanners don't like me. It still looks familiar. Gods, is that the combat music? I hope not. It'd be very, very settling. Let's just drink, even though I don't think it's going to have any effect on... Oh yeah, we're just right there. Hey, you got some food? Oh, you don't trust me. Oh, you also don't trust me. That's fine. Ooh. Is this clothier? That's grocery. You know what? We have time to go to the grocery store, right? And I noticed it's getting darker. almost that time. You know, I, I, I'm bad with remembering maps, so... Oh, hey, a bunch of kids. Hey, kiddo, you got some uh, fish? You still want that? I don't... Uh, I don't know. I'll, I'll think about it. Our Tanya is in the temerity. Wait a second, what is Tanya? Taya, Taya, Tai Cheek? Say a tie cheek, but we call her the Mother Superior. Mother Superior! Isn't that cool as heckin'? It's heckin' cool. Uh, it's Capella's idea. That's cool, alright? Cool as heck, but I need to talk to her. Let's trade. I don't want soap. No, I don't know what that means. Jeez, okay. Taya tie cheek is in the temerity. <laughs> she is the temerity! A giant bunkhouse for our workers, because I, I apparently have workers now. I have no idea. I've been ignorant and neglectful of these workers I have. Come on, I just want to buy some food so I don't starve when I wake up. Hello. I, you don't... Oh, it's... I hate this town. Or I should say, I hate this district. This district just sucks. I have to go all the way down here. I don't know if there's a grocery. There's a grocery here. Gods. I ran all the way back here for nothing. Alright. I know we're gonna let this district die. <laughs> We've inherited the power of of life and death. So this district will die. I think we have time. I mean I'm I'm a little skeptical about that, but we can at least uh go grocery shopping. We pass out. I just... This whole stamina thing. It's a pain. I'm gonna be honest. It is a big pain. Show me front door. But the fact that he just walks so slow. Unless you're doing the stamina. You're gonna do the stamina. Sorry. Didn't mean to click through that so quickly. Um, fish is usually a good idea. I liked smoked meat. Not as good as fresh. Canned food. Filling, although I'm not sure what kind of food is inside. We got a lot of money. Let's stock up. That's what she said. I, though, I don't think we have the space. God damn. I have to put this in our pouch. Uh, I don't know. No, 
And we don't have space. Okay, we're gonna buy the tin. We're gonna use it. Ooh. Yes, I like that. And then we're gonna buy this. Gods, that took up a lot of space. I mean, I don't really have space for anything else as a result. I guess I can get rid of... Oh, there's four of them. No, it's just one. Excuse me, how much? No, you don't want, you won't buy it. Okay. Um, do I just drop it? Drop it, okay. There it is, on the ground. Uh, well, we got some space. Alright. Now, we just need to run. Gods, we're so thirsty. So thirsty. Nope! Not that way. Jeez. Yeah, talk about running the wrong way. I'm about to pass out from exhaustion, but that's okay. I'm gonna run the wrong way. Alright, kiddo, you got anything? Nope. What, you kiddo? Nope. Got all that. Just worried about going the wrong way and then dying from exhaustion and then... Losing the ability to hug. Never held so much appreciation for the fact that you can hug people. Now it's a, what is going on? Lefty, hey Lefty. Uh, it does seem rough to touch, have you tried? They say it is, even if it doesn't look it. Looks greasy though. It's, I like saying, it's like that saying, what was it? Uh, what? Rough as Dutch, safe to touch, smooth as bone, leave it alone. Because the Dutch are rough people. Yeah, that one. Only I always thought it was about the road less taken and such. Rough, I mean, it's a hard choice. Smooth, taking it easy. And we all know where those lead, right? What is this mold? Who knows? Something's wrong with the air. That, that must be it. Some sort of suit from the factory. I guess that's why it was shut down. Only it's... Growing fast and the tinge is wrong. I wonder what they use to fuel or for fuel there. Suit would spread evenly, and this is some sort of mold. Really? I should really just leave this place. Breathing this suit can't be healthy. I mean, especially if you're breathing mold. Uh sure, no need to take pointless risks. Should I touch it? It's right outside our house. Uh what do you want? Don't fret, I got paper from Subarov. Got your hands on a permit, huh? Go on in then, it's your funeral. I'm not scared of a little dirt. How's it our funeral? It's not like there's dead bodies here. Or is there? Jeez, we really need to sleep. But no, this is where the bad shit happens. Oh gods, what's going on? Uh, this house has been defiled. I don't want to live in a place where his blood was spilled, but leaving empty hadn't doesn't sound like a good idea either. We're about to pass out. I'm gonna say... Nothing spooky going on. Oh my god, we're so rich. Come on, just just cancel. Just stack it. I want you to stack on your own. I mean, we're not rich, but we're relatively rich. We have a little bit of money. I'm gonna be honest, I don't care for the sounds I'm hearing. Oh, scalpel. Need. Damn it. Which one has the lowest durability? Don't need the bloody bandage, that's for sure. 
Is this? Oh. I got a bad feeling about this. Here we are. We're sick. We've gotten ourselves the sickness. I just... Twyrine. I instantly regret that. And then I regret that. Uh, I do not fear death. And neither should you. God damn it. Death to a doctor is but a partner in conversation. A constant witness of our work. Even when we succeed. It is not old age or what comes after it that worries me. Taya. VO, Vlad Olginski. Someone is selling... Okay, there's two different places to go. I have a key to a secret factory building. Handy, I can't always sleep at other people's places, after all. Why can't I? I am instead beset by the thought that I might fail to pass on my role. Make haste, son. I truly need you. Your loving father... Isidore Burr. God, what an idiot I was. What have you done? Uh, why are you here? Um, I live here. Well, I come bearing a sanity order, so I'm here to examine and quarantine the place. Uh, you won't like it in there. Really? Why? Their insight is unhealthy somehow. It might irritate your tender skin. <laughs> Something's wrong in there. Is that so? Still, with your kind permission, I insist on examining the place. Even your unkind permission would do. But if you struggle to provide even that, I'll do fine without your consent at all. I hope I don't need to threaten you at gunpoint. Whoa! Dude, seriously? Not... Go ahead, then. Examine the place, and if you can explain what's going on in there, uh, be so kind as to tell me, too. And by the way, what is this strange mold, I guess? Is it mold? That thing your house is covered in. Do you, do houses often get scabs around these parts? Um, I don't know. I've never seen these before. Did we pass out? Nope, he disappeared. All right, we got shit. I don't. Uh... All right, we're running to Olgimsky's place. Great job, kids. Watch the mold. Let me know if it moves. I think we're going the right way. Yes. Um, not gonna stop. Although we should look at this. Touch it. Uh, I found a spare key, but these key thefts are becoming concerning. Your equipment is far from cheap, is it not? It wouldn't serve no one if it was get stolen. And do keep in mind that if our small arrangement is uncovered, I too will have to bear the consequences. Okay, that's why. Oh, we're so goddamn close. So close to exhaustion. Come on, stamina. Don't let me down. I hope we have to fill up, fill it up completely. Before the bad stuff happens. I wanted to stay at Laura's place, but you know. Bad planning on my part. I don't know why. It just seems like the pathologic and the void were some interestingly odd convoluted dating sims. It's like in the void there's these sisters, and you get to pick a sister, or not, that you're gonna go off with. No, we're gonna sleep first. Let's sleep for three, four hours. We need sleep. Alright. Yep. 
Weird dreams, hello. What if I just end up folding? Barax Taglor? Don't be afraid, we're all on the same side for now, aren't we? I know who you are. You're the kids from Father's List. We're all grateful to you. We know protecting us isn't easy, but you still do it. You make sure we live! Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. That's not my goal. There are, are seven of you, but there was an eighth on the list. Where is he? Here, for now. He's the Uderg. Can't see him. Think you can't see the eighth because you're looking the wrong way. But he's here. It's fortunate he's still on this side. Why? Because he's the Uderg. Don't tell me what it is, just say Uderg over and over. If he lives, so do we. If he begins to die, so will be. That's an Uderg, huh? How can it tell me? Awesome. Let me memorize your faces. Yeah, Grace. Yeah, Notkin. Murky. And there's Capella. Capella Bella. Bella Capella. Jeez, I just slept, I thought. The day is over. Some opportunities have been irreversibly missed. Others can still be seized. Several events will unfold this night and become unavailable by dawn. A new pantomime is being rehearsed at the you theater. Have Twelve days. Not so many. Jeez, look at this exhaustion. Like, what am I supposed to do with that? What can I even do with that? Is that a rusty scalpel? Why did I save the rusty scalpel? I don't know. I don't know. But enough. One more day has passed. The town shifts. Something stirs in the theater. Something stirs within you. I know the theater stirs me. Um, apart from the seven kids, there was an eighth on the list. Uderg. An Uderg, perhaps? Um, who or what is that? I suspect I will one day have to find out. I have a key to a secret factory. Sometimes after dark, stubby people meet at Saba's place. Alright. We got some options. We got Saba's. <sighs> we have the theater. We have Khan. We have this factory. Taya Tai Cheek. I don't know which which route to take. I'm gonna be honest. Not sure. Um, well, next time we will do something. Go to one of these places. See what can be done. She's just fine, right? I don't know what that symbol means. Does that mean we can just let... Oh, it's save point and there's a bed there. Lovely. And there's a save point there, but no bed. Bed and save point. Save point, no bed. Save point and, I don't know, money? We can buy stuff there. Okay. That's what that means. Bar, I don't know who bar. Oh, organ buying person. Well, if we ever need to buy organs... Uh, save point, Capella's wing. That's not going to tell us. Save point, selling. Workshop 2. Alright, next time, uh, we continue, and we're on day 3, and we'll see who dies. Surprisingly, no one died for day 2. Oh, Alex Subarov, The Bones. Okay, now seriously this time, next time.